Now, got to get up to that resistance. If I get uh, the open of the bar opens just below that resistance, or that happens. All right, so I got a good fill. I shorted the uh, YM, and I'm out plus five. We've been pushing up, like from almost from the open, strong push, kind of consolidated a bit here. They continued this strong push up. This is a bigger push than it looks. The scale of the chart is zoomed out so that it can encompass the the amount of uh, movement that we've had over this period. So the chart's actually quite zoomed out here. So this is a bigger move than it than it appears. We uh, we moved and plowed right into this. Uh, major line of resistance right here and look what happened to price as soon as it hit that this bar opened and we have a divergent condition with a major line of resistance right behind us so you see we have the strong momentum it's going from the black bars to the medium color gray bars the lighter the color of the bars the more imminent the exhaustion potential then we got a speed tick and a pullback alert. Okay, this pullback alert says that there that the even though we had a lot of buyers, we had some sellers waiting up in this area. That's why we have this blue dot here. We have identified that those sellers are now coming in. And at the same time we have a divergent condition. So this bar opened just below this resistance with this divergence and down it went this is our strength right here this is our sweet spot this is where we have a high probability of understanding and knowing what's about to happen after this move here we don't really have anything to tell us that it's going to continue to drop here so we take advantage of this move right here. Now, you'll notice price is going back up again. We don't care. We're already out of this trade. We identified this weakness in an uptrend, which is what we're looking for. We're looking for weakness in an uptrend or strength in a downtrend. This bar open, drop, we all hit our targets, and off it goes.